So for the past uh, couple of years, uh, we've been working with the Institute of Physics. And the greatest impact for us has been the, the lighting in the eyes of, and how the faces light up of the students that we've been working with in trying to explain to them that learning physics, chemistry, or maths, or biology in the classroom setting, uh, if taken further into the real world, it can be used to solve the challenges and problems faced in our communities. The other aspect is that we're preparing them for university. So when they go to university, they can still take up those programs and scale them up, work with the professors, and now do real research. What they're doing now is just an opener at from five or from six. It's an opener and opening for them to see the possibilities. Once they see the possibilities, then the, the sky is the limit. And this is why we thank IOP for coming up with a suggestion so that we can work together in order we can have better students well-informed students, students who are always looking for answers, not just cramming, but working and doing the, re the initial research and analysis in order so that they can come up with viable solutions, viable products that will have an impact on the economy and the social well-being of our people in this country. And in, in doing so, even the teachers get transformed, even the schools get a new outlook in terms of how they can do things. And this way we're also building that little, little tiny thing which we call the linkages between academics, industry, and knowledge as a whole. You know, another private, private what we call the PPP, private-public sector collaboration.